Just how profound this house. The things that happened in this house are just so profoundly important. Not just to Birmingham, but, but for, for, the, for the world. And, you know, her dad connected dots like, like nobody's business. He was really doing at the time because he was courageous, he was a brilliant attorney, and he made a difference in the civil rights struggle. And few people have, have, have really just sort of forgotten about him, but he left a living legacy. Remember, I was with you over here at Christmas time last year, and Barbara had a little, little bit of eggnog, and uh, <laughs> I was excited about the eggnog, and she said, you know, that was Martin's class. I totally didn't understand what she had just said until she said, and this is where Thurgood Marshall would sit, was happening. My father was in Washington receiving an award, and Thurgood came over to the program and everything. But they had been friends over the years, because when he would come when we were younger, when Thurgood would come to the house, he was always a, a regular person, and my sister was really into cowboys. And when Third Good would come, Helen would ride his back on his knees and hands, crawling and running. <laughs> and Helen's on his back, hitting his wrist, saying, Giddy up, boys, giddy up. And at one time, when he went back, he knew how much Helen loved cowboys that he sent us these blankets. This is a very special blanket that me when I was real young. I guess I was about six or seven at the time. And I'm still holding on to mine. <laughs> 